Hey YouTube, we're back with another Battle Spot video. Um, so this was recorded when I was just messing around on uh, Battle Spot 3 Battle with stuff that I don't usually run in my main team, but do Pokemon I do like. Um, and we're going up against Dino. So uh, we're bringing to the battle Marak, uh, Mega Maroil, and Heraxus. And Dino is going to bring with him uh, Venusaur, which I'm before his match I assumed was his Mega. It's the only thing he got in his squad that could Mega Evolve. Um, Sandslash and Venonat. So a nice few pokes you don't see very often. Don't see many Venonats. Definitely don't see many Sandshrews. Um, which is one of the things I actually prefer about the free battle on Battle Spot. You do tend to see a lot of stuff you wouldn't normally see in a matchup. So let's get straight into it. So Dino is issuing a challenge, um, so I'm going to lead with Marowak, um, now Marowak is one of my favourite Pokemon um, ever since Gen 1, um, obviously he's very slow, and uh, but has got really really good attack, um, he does get some new toys in this one, so I thought we'd give him a quick try, so then that's going to go for the sleep head which is going to pop us to sleep, um, what I didn't want to do is switch in another one and take another sleep, him predict that and go for another sleep powder, instead he's going in for the quiver dance, um, so we're going to stay in one more turn just to see what it does. Um, it's going to get its special attack and speed boots. Uh, we are going to get a lucky wake up turn two though. And we're going to get a fire punch off on the Venonat. Which is going to do a good amount of damage. And we go for another sleep pad that misses. Um, and we're going for a thunder punch out of time. Um, just in case he decided to switch. He had got a couple of water types on his team. Which I thought he might go into. Um, out comes Don Patch. So Don Patch is the shiny sand, sand slash, which is really nice to see. Um, he's going to get his sandstorm up. That's not going to bother Marowak too much. So we don't need to worry about damage from that. We're going for a knockoff just to see what item he's got in case he's got anything that uh, might cause us some problems, which he had got left over. So that was really nice to remove that. And he's going to go for an EQ, which will do a good amount of damage. But as I say, Marowak's pretty bulky for a little Pokemon, so... Uh, we're going to return the favour with another EQ. So at this point I'm thinking I'm just going to trade EQs with him. Um, he does go for a Swords Dance, which is fine. Um, didn't want to switch anything in at that point, so I didn't want anything taking it. Definitely can't bring Maral in on this thing, so one EQ would pop her. Uh, going to try another Earthquake off, which is going to get him down into red. Um, this EQ is going to do a lot because of the Swords Dance, yeah, which is going to take us out. Um, so didn't feel any need to mess around with this thing anymore. Uh, needed out of the way in case I need to bring my rod in later. So we're going to go out into Heraxus. Um, we are going to break the mould. Mould's being broken all the way. And we're just going to straight up Dragon Claw it to stop it getting any more fun and damage off. So that is going to kill it. And we are Life Orb. And that comes Tallulah. What I love now is you've now got a nicknames on Battle Spot, which is brilliant. Something that a lot of people have been asking for for a while. It's going to Mega Revolve Tallulah. So Tallulah the Venusaur. Uh, now I figured he was going to try and set up. So what I didn't want to do is get to a position where he was going to storm me out quite easily. So I'm going to set an own Dragon Dance up. I'm expecting a Leech Seed or an Ingrain. Um, it does go for an Ingrain in the end. Uh, and now we're just going to get as much damage off on this thing as quickly as we can. So we can't stall us out with um, Leech Seed Synthesis. Uh, and that Dragon Claw is going to one hit KO. Crit probably did matter to be fair, but we'd have probably KO'd it next turn anyway. Particularly with the Life Orb boost. And um, that's the end of the game. Uh, cheers guys, if you enjoyed that please leave a like or comment down below. And I'll speak to you soon.